Congressman, Colonel, great to see you. Thank you so much for adding to the conversation this morning. Give us your assessment of the activity on the ground now that Vladimir Putin has escalated this around the nuclear assets in Ukraine. Well, thank you for having me, Maria. It is a tragedy. Uh, our prayers go out to the Ukrainian people. I mean, this is exactly the situation uh, that we've been talking about avoiding for so long. Uh, and I'll rewind the clock. I mean, when President Biden decided to chase these failed policies, uh, the Green New Deal narrative, attacking our domestic supply, canceling Keystone Pipeline, that led to this environmental weakness. The environmental weakness led to the vulnerabilities that we see around the world. And those vulnerabilities have allowed Putin to gain this leverage and give him the impetus to invade. It is time to put Midland over Moscow. And now we have a nuclear facility that is being threatened by Vladimir Putin. And, you know, we've been meeting with parliament mem members all week uh, from Ukraine uh, on the phone and in person. They're extremely worried about what his next step will be. He does not care about uh, the value of life. He is indiscriminately killing civilians and energy security is national security. That has led us to this point. We must sanction the energy sector to absolutely bring Putin and the regime down.